Hi, my name is Gerard Bukes. I'm the CEO of Scala, and uh, I'm, we are super excited here to be at DSE in Las Vegas. It's certainly uh, our favorite event of the year. Um, yeah, Scala, as, as uh, yeah, most of uh, you know, is, is uh, the sort of global leader in digital signage, and we've been around for 22 years. Um, yeah, we certainly pioneer this industry, so we are sort of the, the uh, how can I say, the, the uh, oldest uh, company in the block. And uh, yeah, we absolutely have loved the, the whole DSE experience. I think one of, one of the key things that's changing in the industry is until now, most of the, uh, call it playback, the media player devices were based on PC technology, you know, uh, PC compatible uh, computers. Whereas, you know, what's one of the key things that's changing in the last 12 months, and we have a number of new products related to that, is really the whole, uh, um, a media player appliance, a much lower cost platform, and, and certainly here's a good example of that. See, these are much smaller, they're easier, they, they're normally solid state, they don't have a, uh, they're, they're a lower cost and, and no fans and no moving part. So that's one of the key changes in the industry. You can now, the, the whole uh, cost uh, point and the return on investment is much better than it used to be because the actual pieces you need, the hardware pieces, are coming down dramatically in price. Yeah, another uh, interesting thing in the, in the background there is obviously it's a new product from a company called Kirsty Digital, which are called micro tiles. And this is really so you can build any shape of digital signage. So uh, you know, behind me you can sort of see like a sort of staircase effect. And it gives you all sorts of new and exciting methodologies of, of, of displaying things in unusual places, of building sort of almost like an architectural type of, of um, of live you know, uh, display. So uh, people use it in all sorts of interesting places and I think if you see what's, what's going on behind me as, as, as I'm talking here, you, you can see the sort of effect and, and the exciting things you can do with that. And yeah, one of the key points in our software is that we can sort of drive you know, anything of any shape and any size. And another good example would be even sports stadiums, where uh, you know typically you know these sort of uh, banners around the edge of sports stadiums, sort of a ribbon. You can make them all appear like one sort of giant, let's call it single device, and mo move things around there. And and um, you know, so there's all sorts of application for digital signage actually. The uh, uh, owners of the Hubble Space Telescope, tele telescope you know, is actually NASA, and they have you know, a, a division called Space Telescope Institute. Uh, they use Scala, they use our software, and it's in about you know, over 200 museums around the world. And what they've done is you know, they take these thousands or zillions, actually, of these uh, pictures in outer space with the Hubble Space Telescope, and how do they give that back to the taxpayer or back to the people? And they have the so-called outreach program and installed in a, you know, more than 200 museums around the U.S. and, in fact, some even outside the U.S., where they do a whole story on space. And they control it all from Washington, D.C., from their uh, head office and yeah the museums love it because it's sort of a live exhibit so you know they just put up a screen you know obviously with our software and a computer on there put some benches in front of it and effectively it's updated you know regularly and frequently with a new show and there's another interesting you know, example of the versatility of what digital signage is all about. And a lot of people don't realize that it's not only about advertising in retail stores. In fact, there's a lot more to it than just simply advertising in retail stores. Digital signage, join the revolution.